Now, my next guest's career spans more than six decades. She's been in some of my favourite shows, everything from Doomwatch to the Duchess of Duke Street. And since 1985, she's made Albert Square her home, bringing to life the wonderful Dot Brennan. She's the one and only June Brown. Let's see. <laughs> Have you just come straight uh, from... No, I'm not stopping long, dear, because I've got to get to work this evening. OK. Yes. I've just popped in. Do you want to sit down? Well, I thought I'd ought to go across to the organ. No, a bit later on, we'll do the oh, organ. Oh, I thought I was going to be playing No, today. a bit later, a bit later. You're booked for later. I'll just so, take my coat... Oh, take your coat me. off, June. Coat yeah, off. give us your bag of gear. No, oh, I wanted to thank you for these. Can you hear me? Because I might be muffled by my coat. <laughs> You can hear me. What yes. the gift? Yeah, no, the well, no, you see, he brought me all these lovely gifts. I mean, really, between you and me, that's the only reason I came on. But <laughs> I wasn't able to get him anything, which is terribly sad, because I haven't had time to shop. So I thought I'd give him my autograph. <laughs> you are kind. Thank you, Ah, oh, Jim, thanks very much. <laughs> I'll put you up there with Gypsy Rose Lane, you're in good company. <laughs> How are you, June? I'm not doing a strip tease. <laughs> <laughs> you have done in the past when you were Junie Mae Brown. <laughs> <laughs> How's things? How's things? Well, I suppose they're right. Excuse me a Take moment. your coat off, make well, yourself... Me... Oh, yes, I bought it. <laughs> Well, I thought you'd... At least, I mean, I'm not naked, but I am dressed in a sparkly fashion. <laughs> <laughs> That's for Christmas, so don't look like By the time she settled herself down, it'll be half nine tonight. <laughs> <laughs> well, yes, and I can't stop long, as I said before. Hello. Hello. Have you done all your Christmas shopping? I haven't done any, darling. That's what I mean. That's why you only got an autograph. <laughs> <laughs> Have you sent your cards? No. No. <laughs> I do. I've got them. I've got them with me. <laughs> well, actually, you're a nuisance to me today in one way. <laughs> and what? not a nuisance in another. Well, you see, I was going in very early to work to do all my cards and for those nice people who send me them, and I'll try to send them back. And if I don't get them done today because it's my last day, they're not going to get a card, so that's your fault. <laughs> so, oh, oh, Paul, do you mind? You don't mind if I speak? No, <laughs> no. <laughs> Try shutting that up. Well, I, I must say this on behalf of Barbara Windsor because she's very worried because she normally sends thousands of cards. She really does. And anyway, she can't because she cracked her wrist, you see. Mm -hmm. So she can't write. So her money is going to charity. So if any of you send her a card and you don't get one back, it's gone to charity. There you are. Oh, there you are. Very nice. That's a good idea. Isn't it? Well, did she get a wrist? Well, you know that when you're filming, we were doing all that church stuff, you get a van for the food. Yeah. You know all that, of course, yeah. don't you? And it has steps up without a rail, a platform with a rail where you get your food, and more steps down the other side without a rail. She's in her shoes, dear, her high heels with a bacon sandwich. <laughs> and uh, she's coming down the steps, dear, and there's a leaf and... Psh, oh, dear. And did her rest then? All Aww. this was swollen, luckily Aww. not broken, cracked the bone, but didn't didn't really break it, so... Can I just say, seen. why are you getting yes. your own breakfasts on a, on the Sorry, steps? That... Haven't they got a runner to go and get your breakfast? I don't quite? think I've got my <laughs> <seat time. laughs> I really didn't do that on purpose. <laughs> June Brown, don't kid a kid her. I'm telling you now. <laughs> <laughs> is that showing? Is that showing? No, it's not showing. You're OK. Right. No. no. A little bit, yeah. Is There's a bit of um, thermal vest popping me. out. Tuck, tuck, what, dear? Uh, is that the thermal vest? Yes. Yeah, that's just tuck it in. <laughs> that's it. No, you've got to keep warm, haven't There's you? glamour. Glamour. <laughs> layers, June, layers. So, listen, can you just tell me something? Is this vodka or gin? <laughs> <laughs> gin. Nice. Get it down, you <laughs> <laughs> ah, Terrible acting, that was. <laughs> Who has killed Pauline Fowler? Come on, Joan, spill the beans. No, I cannot oh. say that. You, do you know who I think it is? Who? Sonia. Oh, well, do that's you? one yeah, option. I think it's Now, I'll tell you what, who finds out? Who finds out? Dot finds out. 
Yeah. yeah, she does a detective Nancy work. She practices marbles mm. and she finds out. Oh, really? Yes, and they kind of get there. You notice I don't say he or she. They are just. You're deserved. very clever, June, aren't oh, you? Oh, you have to be so careful. <laughs> <laughs> Has that been in the police force? <laughs> have you? No, I haven't been in the police force. <laughs> <laughs> Me in the police force? Are you sure? <laughs> I've been in a wagon on a few occasions, but <laughs> never actually dressed as an officer, you know. <laughs> What's what it going to be like that, without Wendy? That lovely Lily Savage I saw in Edinburgh years oh, ago. Oh, remember her? Yeah. She was the original Lily and she had this great beehive, didn't she? That's it was right. a big wig and this narrow face and a short skirt and high heels That's right. and a bag. She was a little Liverpool housewife and he was very, very funny. You know where she is now, don't you? She's Gone. in a convent. Oh, no. <laughs> no. Seriously. She saw the edit of her ways and she joined a bunch of Carmelite nuns where she can't speak. And when you go and see her, you speak to her through a grill. <laughs> Not in the door. She's always barbecuing. So she has a single. But apparently, she sends her love to you and she's quite happy. Oh, she's that's quite happy. Right. I'm very surprised because it's hard if you're a talker not to talk. Yeah, but she's. I, I think... know the help from experience. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me, how are you going to cope with that, Wendy? Because you two are great oh, pals. Yes, and I know you're down the green room together in yes, the smoker's well, end. No, we're, 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 yeah, well, but don't smoke. Now, I'll tell you why not smoke. Don't bother about your health. The latest thing I've found out is your eyes. To begin with, it was your teeth when the gums receded and you had horses' teeth and you have to have them doctored. But they don't come out, but they've been doctored. <laughs> and then the next thing is your voice, because I had a rather lovely... <laughs> I'm being very serious. <laughs> I'm giving my health advice here. I had all this. We went to see a play and she sat next to me. I had all this through the play. Did you? <laughs> you were telling me of the tablets you said you were saying to you, you must take this. No, I could take ta lecithin and vitamin B3. I said, didn't what I? What does lecithin do? It well, multiplies it demulsifies cholesterol. the fat. Yeah, yeah. Yes. An egg yolk has uh, lecithin in it, in case you're interested. They say don't eat egg yolk. <laughs> but it's got its own lecithin to emulsify its fat. There's nothing wrong with an egg yolk. <laughs> <laughs> And what else do you take, June? What other pills? Oh, Prescription tablets we're talking about. Milk thistle, um, general one, <laughs> omega-3, omega-369, folic acid, <laughs> ginkgo. Uh, I expect I've forgotten a few. What time do you get up to take all these tablets? Let's <laughs> <laughs> go up about four o'clock in the morning. I can now do it very fast and almost swallow without anything. A quick little thing. <laughs> <laughs> I would have been good on those pies. <laughs> you no, would have. I wouldn't. Been. I thought they were going to be <laughs> oh, sick any too. minute. Ooh, I thought ooh, I did you eat. say you'd have done better on the crackers with me than Dee? Because <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't. No. We'd have not got past the first one because I haven't got any muscles. We'd still be <laughs> doing this. <laughs> <laughs> Can we show a clip of Christmas Day at your Dan oh, Albert Square? Oh, I look awful. You won't look awful. You always say face. this. You look fat. Don't you look great? She looks oh. 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 No, Sorry, no, Jane. No, Sorry. No, no. I've Whatever just, you're doing, I've it works. just had my passport photo taken because I can't go anywhere except Scotland and Ireland and Wales and here because I haven't got a passport. And it was so awful, it depressed me. And do you know, I think I left it in the shop because I can't find it. <laughs> <laughs> what, the passport? The photograph. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was going to bring it to show you the contrast between my natural beauty. <laughs> And the passport <laughs> photograph, but I lost it, so I'll have to... I'll go and have them taken now, I think. Because you're looking good today. Yeah, you're looking good today. Well, it's fabulous. the makeup girls, you see. The dents are gone, the big bags. <laughs> <and> the... <laughs> Let's have a look at each Albert Square minute. Christmas Day while I take a pill. <laughs> <laughs> you're the only real friend I got left. 60 years I've known you. I can still see you as a little girl, little Pauline Beale, with Lou fussing around you, telling you off. And... Your father built in you that doll's house one Christmas, do you remember? Oh, I adored you. You was his golden-haired little angel. I can't talk about that with no one else. I can't replace them years. Neither of us can. Stay, Pauline. Make sense before it's too late. I love that quote. That is Shabby Dandy's quote. Was it? It was Andy.
Angie's coat. They've just yes, recycled it. That, Was that see? Angie's coat? That's Angie's coat. Angie gave it to Doc when she left for Spain 20 years ago. <laughs> it's, it's doing well, isn't it? Well, nearly all my clothes are anything from 22 downwards. <laughs> <laughs> How's your donkey? Can I ask you that? Oh, they're lovely. Yes, they're very healthy. Need a bit of money. Anybody got any spare like Barbara for charity at Christmas? Michael Elliott Trust. Peak Forest. Yeah. Yeah. I nearly said Dorset. Uh, Where is it, dear? <laughs> it's Blackpool, isn't no, it? No, it's not. It's up there in the north. I see your brain goes when you get older. <laughs> Derbyshire! <laughs> I'll have to have another pill. Oh, don't. <laughs> it does. Why do I feel like I'm at the Mad Ass's tea party? <laughs> <laughs> June, I love you. Ladies and gentlemen, June Brown. Let's hear it for June. Your business, you are. You're no. fine. <laughs> no, you don't. You be yourself. There's not enough of that in this game. Right. Now I'm thoroughly exhausted. I think it's time for me to go over and tickle the ivories as we play the £2,000 organ 